We are grateful to those who invest in Bethel Woods and in the future of our community. We are a cultural center and a museum that is unique in this region, like a Lincoln Center in the middle of the country. And support from our audiences, program attendees, donors and volunteers make this all possible. To me, Bethel Woods means continuity. Something very special happened there a long time ago, but that wasn't the end of it. Remembering the 60s and the things that happened then and putting them to the work today is what the important work of Bethel Woods really is. We provide free access to performances for groups that cannot afford tickets, and we rely on donations to help support the cost of all of our programs. Schools in most cases have reduced or eliminated most, if not all, their cultural programs. We need to inspire young people. Teachers can't do it alone. We feel a responsibility to play our part. We are here to support those efforts. We are here to help. Without Bethel Woods, I really truly feel that art would be a missing piece for our school district. I had one kid that came up to me at the Harvest Festival on Sunday and said, Mrs. Sorensen, thank you for booking the Bethel Woods trip to the museum because I've always wanted to go with my classmates and now it's happening. And she hugged me. I couldn't, like, I just, it, this is what's happened. Bethel Woods is more than just concerts. It's a lot more than the big events, but I don't think if you got us to the big events, you'd have ever had the opportunity to expose us to all the other good stuff, both community and the differences that are just not splashy big shows. We became donors to Bethel Woods because we realized that they do so many great things within the community. Today, many of our region's children, young adults and families, really don't have the ability or resources to experience cultural events. Grants and contributions enable us to provide scholarships and free transportation to get folks here. Probably the biggest challenge for families and working parents. When I found out about the scholarship, I, I was surprised, I was happy, and I, was, I couldn't wait to tell my daughter. She's more confident now. She's singing all the time. Well, the moment that I definitely tipped the scales and felt like a changed person was the night of the show when I got up on the stage and I started reciting the poem and I had all of my closest friends behind me and cheering me on, you know, from behind the little curtain. And when I was finished reciting it and everybody clapped and I took that bow and I got back off of the stairs and everybody just told me that I did a great job and then I realized that I I was changed. Every little bit of money donated definitely helps because it's gonna go into some kids' lives. It's gonna help some kid for the better. There are so many good things that have happened as a result of Bethel Woods. You can look at the economic development. You can look at the number of kids who are served by the education programs. You can look at the sheer entertainment value. But more importantly, it's carrying a spirit. It started back in the 1960s forward. And so for that, Thank you. Thank you with all my heart um, for giving us the opportunity. Thank you. Keep doing what you're doing because it benefits a lot of people. That's, That's a wrap. wrap. <laughs>